we're going to explain how to implement a cycloconverter. The main objective of the cycloconverter is to obtain a variable frequency AC waveform from a frequency of 60 Hz. As we can see in here, we are using a zero cross detector circuit and for synchronizing and making the frequency variable, we are using a microcontroller. In this case, it's the JM60 by Freescale. And we can see in here that in the power stage, we're using an H bridge implemented with triax. We are using a couple of optocoppers in order to isolate the digital part with the stage power. power. As we can see in here, we have two outputs from the microcontroller in order to vary the frequency. One output for each arm of the cycloconverter. One of the main applications of the cycloconverter is the control of the speed of an AC motor. In this case, we have a 5 amp AC motor. We can actually control the speed of the motor by changing the angle of shot of the triangle. Here we have the voltage waveform from the motor, so we can see we can see that we can we are able to change the frequency. In this case, we have more frequency, so less is the speed.